to my channel. My name is Shakija or Kija. Go by both. Um, today I will be doing an update on me taking Wagovi and my weight loss journey. How I got from 250, now I am down to 227. And I will be telling you about all the side effects that I have with Wagovi, the pros and the cons for me taking it and why I'm taking it. So I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please like, comment, subscribe, and share my content. I also have other videos on my channel with fashion, my faith journey, my faith journey, etc. But yeah, let's get started. So I am currently on the dose of 1.7. I started the Legovi back in June of 2023. And right now, uh, just in case you were wondering the timeline, uh, since I don't know when you're going to watch this video, it is December 4th, 2023 right now. So right now I am on the 1.7 dose uh, and you take this once a week, the same day once a week, and you inject it either into your arm, stomach, or your thigh. So everyone wants to know the side effects first, so I'll go over that. You'll hear my son in the background because I am a mother and he's going to talk and, you know, he probably wants to be in the video too. So don't mind the background noise. So the side effects when I first started with Govi is nausea, headaches, for me, vomiting. Um, was there anything else? Nausea, headaches, vomiting, and maybe like a little bit of stomach pain, a little bit of cramps. Uh, do I still have those symptoms? Yes, I do. I still have them, especially within the first week of taking them. That's when I usually get them. Also, some of the symptoms that I have uh, that some people don't experience is when I eat. <laughs> my husband is saying Santiago, my son's name. When I eat greasy food, um, I can't eat it. Like, like I said, uh, it does cause vomiting. I can't eat a certain type of food, greasy food, a lot of red uh, sauces doesn't work well for me. Um, I already have acid reflux and then the Wagovi added on to it. So that does not work for me at all. Um, the headache part, the headaches are a little bit much uh, within that first day of taking it it might be something where you can't handle it if you're a person that doesn't get headaches often like me i always got headaches so it was something that i could handle but you know everyone is different so those are basically the side effects that i got when i took Legovi. like i said i went from 250 now i'm down to 227 um my goal weight is to get into the hundreds i don't care if it's 199 i'll be happy with that but my goal weight is to get to 175 and then go from there. But I'm proud of how far I came. Now, the Wagovi is not something where uh, you think you're going to take it and, you know, you're going to keep the weight off that way. Uh, it will decrease your appetite and make you eat less and make you not want to eat it. But you do have to be active. Also, you want to be active, too, because you if you don't be active, you're going to be really soggy. And I'm just going to be completely honest. Your skin is going to start to sag, um, which is not fun. Right now, what I need to do, and I'm not doing, I'm being completely honest, what I need to do more is I need to do more weights to start to tighten up my skin because there is something where I do not want a lot of loose skin. I would rather be a lot bigger uh, than this than have loose skin. I don't like the way it looks. Well, actually, healthy, healthy is the way to go. Um, but yeah, so you do want to stay active and stay fit because that's how you lose weight, especially if you have a deadline and you're trying to lose weight faster. The more active you are, the more weight you lose. This is just something that suppresses your appetite. Wagovi is not Ozempic. So it's uh, Ozempic is used for people that are pre-diabetic. I am on Wagovi because I had high cholesterol and my BMI level. So that's why I got prescribed Wagovi because you do have to talk to a doctor in order to get on Wagovi. And I did not want to be on Exempic, on Exempic because people that actually need that, need that. And that's not what I needed. I wanted to get down one because I have a family. So my health comes first. 
And two, because I didn't really feel good where I was before. Like I felt like the bigger I got, the more boxy I am. And I feel like my shape is starting to come back because I was somebody that was actually smaller and got bigger. So when I got bigger, I realized that I was getting more of a box shape and my hourglass shape was um, disappearing where now I see it coming back. And I'm really happy about that. So yeah, now I see it coming back. I see my waist coming back. Like I said, y'all, I really have ways to go, but I'm very thankful for where I am now. I wanted to make sure my mic was on. But overall, this is a short video. This is just, you know, I've been saying that I'm going to do updates on my weight loss journey. And this is just an update to tell you how it's going. It's going amazing. It did take time. Like I said, I started in June and it is now December. I, it, you're not going to lose weight. If you want something that's going to be fast and you lose weight right away, this might not be something for you. It takes you about three months because they have to increase your doses for you to start to lose weight. So you're not going to lose weight right away. This is something where you have to be patient, consistent, and be active. If you be patient, consistent, consistent and active, then you're probably going to lose weight on Wagovi. If you're not like that, then you're probably not. And this is something where it is a forever drug. Um, just to give you guys a heads up, if you're not on it forever, you're probably going to gain it back. If you're not going to be active, you're going to have to keep the same routine that you have now um, with, with, with the Wagovi after you stop taking it, if it's something where you stop taking it. That's pretty much my video. Um, this is just a weight loss update. I will keep updating y'all. Hopefully I have an update in January with more weight loss. I want to get out of the 20s, the 220s. If I could get out of the 220s in January, that would be crazy. My son is acting up, so I got to start playing with him because it's playtime for him. But that's pretty much my video, guys. If y'all like it and y'all want to come with me on my weight loss journey, please like, comment, and subscribe. You guys have a wonderful, blessed day.